Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Spiritual Readiness and the Time of the Shift. We're living in quite extraordinary time. The planet and humanity are on the verge of a major evolutionary change and growth. But it is also a very perilous time for in order for a new edifice to be built, the old has to be demolished. This is true in us internally, so we have to do the shadow work that's necessary to disconnect us to the old belief system of survival and all the emotions that are attached to it so that we can begin to create the new reality that we want to exist in. All of us individually and collectively are doing this. This, however, uh, enters another level of complication because the forces that have been cultivating a, uh, an entire existence of survival for the past few thousand years will not go down easy. And I'm not talking about just inst planetary institutions. I am talking also about principalities, disembodied uh, fallen celestial beings who are of vested interest on all of us remaining in the 3D reality, <clears throat> while the emerging energy that's rising up, that's taking us into the higher densities and the evolution change uh, is still uh, in the process, as not completely grounded. Now, uh, I want to uh, 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 foreshadow this by saying that next week, for my next video, I will talk about the actual Twilight Masters and actual uh, individual uh, modalities and false beliefs that are pervasively being spread out there, trying to dissuade all of us who have a mission and a purpose for this uh, uh, coming change. But today I want to talk about something much more specific, which is the 5G network that has been, or that the planet um, under the influence of principalities have now begun to deploy. And the effect that it has in my practice, I'm not talking about what other people are seeing or perceiving. I'm not a scientist. I want to qualify this by just saying this. But I can tell you, in my practice for the past month, what I have witnessed is terrifying. And as these clients are coming to me feeling um, a sense of loss in their spiritual clarity, they're inside shaking. They are shaking but from the inside or a sense that um, they have headache, migraines, or blurry vision, or off axis in some ways, feeling completely disempowered as if something is not right, that they are not comfortable in their skin, that they've seen dramatic deterioration in their bodies, in the way they exist in their body in a very short time, usually a few months, okay? And when I do a clearing for them, which is the process by which I do an implant and device removal from them, the first one that I did terrified me because the cellular structure of every cell in the body was disintegrated, was, was being dissolved, bottom line. And because we have a natural protection system in, um, in us, that each cell exists in a kind of magnetic um, um, has a magnetic field around it. That magnetic field, when the cellular structure is destroyed, is disintegrated. And when that happens, then implant and devices can enter and lock into the system. And I had to spend time removing all of these things out to give them and reset the cellular structure back before the attack occurred. And the last piece of this was to help them find immunity against this kind of infection. Now, I'm not trying to spread rumors, but I'm just using statistics. I have six people in the past month and a half who came to me with this problem. Three of them re either resided or had traveled to Europe. I don't know what stage of development 
uh, in Europe right now that the, uh, the 5G network is, but that's the evidence that I have. It's very limited. I'm not saying that that's what it is. I'm just saying my personal experience, okay? I could be wrong. It could have been deployed in the U.S. much more than, uh, than, uh, than in Europe. I don't know. But from the experience that I have, which is the six individuals that I've treated, three of them either resided or had, had traveled to Europe for um, a period, um, two weeks to, to, to a month at least, and came back completely disempowered. I want to make you aware of this. If this resonates with you, seek somebody that knows how to do a clearing. And, and, and have them remove the devices and the effect of these um, 5G network, again, influenced definitely by dark principalities to create a disruption in cellular structure and thus keep us, for those of us who have a mission and a purpose, in helping in this transition into the new earth, holding all of us back. Be aware of this, be on the lookout for this. I hope this video has educated you in some ways. Uh, I want to thank you for listening to me, and I'll talk to you next week. Thank you.